feel like you're trying to sabotage this trio of quick looks before it even gets started. H- how is that? Uh, I'm, I'm not even... What? You gave me this hard candy, this Zots. Mm, and it's like a ticking zots. time bomb in the corner of my mouth that yeah. is going to explode in fizzy... Yeah. Fizzy flavor at some point over the course of this. But and Zots I'm, are delicious. It, it's I, I'm liking it. It's been a long time since I have Zotted. Yeah, I don't know what happened, but Zots just seemed like they just came back. I find them all over the place now. Weird, yeah. That's variety of that's delicious crazy. Zots flavors. Uh, well, Sega has put out three fighting games uh, from their uh, Model 2 era arcade uh, stuff this yeah. week. Five bucks a pop. All, all at once. We've all got, at once, uh, yeah. Virtual which, Fighter you know. 2, Fighting Vipers, and Sonic Champions. Sonic the Fighters. Or Sonic the Fighters. Sonic Championship in, in one of the uh, compilations they did, but... Uh, they they're they're back to calling it Sonic the Fighters uh, which uh, for was this, the which is the Japanese, Japanese name. Yeah. It never really got released here really well. Okay. Um, some version differences for for VF2. If, oh. you, if you like the original 2.0 instead of the 2.1, they made some balance changes sure. that I cannot detail for you here. Um, they've got online in them, which is cool. Mm-hmm. And uh, you know they maintain the aspect ratio, and it's 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 Virtual Fighter 2 for five bucks. Five, one, ready. Moving on. No. Um, it, 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 do you get the sense that they've done anything to it visually uh, or are they keeping it pretty no they're, they're keeping it pretty gully you yeah. know it's, this is a uh... I, mean, I, I, I want to say it's been friggin' forever since I've seen Virtua Fighter 2 in the arcades which is right. what I assume they're basing this off yeah, of yeah. Uh, rather than any sort of home version uh, but I don't recall it necessarily moving as smoothly as this does I, it was always a very smooth game okay. um, but yeah it's, it's just one of those things that you know when it came home in weird forms it never really came home right no so uh, you know you, you might be used to seeing one of those home versions sure but there's there try was, next stage there was also a pretty significant jump between uh one and two as far as oh yeah both yeah speed I mean, you know, and, shading and, and textures and just like model one to model two huge changes yeah 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 also even just the amount of polygons on each fighter I mean, oh. we, we can stretch it but dude don't, don't like that yeah i would i you know i know that it it changes a lot about with fighting games specifically to change the aspect ratio yeah, yeah. uh but i still when i see games like this i i i I'd like an option, you know? Yeah, it's just one of those things that, you know, it does. You're right. It, 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 from a balance perspective, if... Well, I mean, we can get pretty far apart, so maybe, you know, doing it widescreen wouldn't actually I, have... I guess that's a bigger issue on meaningful 2D Meaningful gameplay changes, yeah. For, for the, the distance issue. Uh, but if you can... It's just a matter of how they do it. Like, you know, if, if they make it so you can only get as far apart as the screen is wide mm-hmm. and don't zoom out to let you get further away, then, then you know, widescreen will be different. Yeah. Um, yeah, that'd be... Yeah. But again, but also it's five bucks, so... Oh, yeah, yeah, I, and, and, I and that's a, a, a maybe a questionable addition to begin with, because yeah. it, it would be a change, so... Um, I'm just saying, personally, I always like the like the option, at least. Like, there's something to be said for yeah. keeping it totally arcade true, uh, but... In, 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 a, in a polygonal game like this, where, at least from a, a technological standpoint, it would not be uh, as uh, difficult or... It, it, doesn't seem as much of a technical challenge to just like, you know, pull out the edges of the screen. Yeah. Than, than in a two D game. At the same time, you know, I, that, I think that makes some assumptions about the timing and you know yeah. the, the emulation and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, that absolutely right. Doing that could break a zillion different things. Right. That could and it would just require Ocean. more work. Whereas as it is, that uh, guy's you know, ripped. Their their work is restricted to make this run as well as it did originally. I have uh, played too much newer Virtua Fighter and going back to VF2, uh-huh. to VF2 Sarah, as opposed to like VF4, VF5 Sarah. A little challenge. Yeah, it's kind of hard. I say because f- I didn't really play a lot of Sarah until four. Until four, so that was a kind of a, a, a big jump for the series at four, right? Um, I think four got it back on track. I think three was a mess. Okay, you think three was where it kind of lost the yeah. Lost like, the plot like four kind of four kind of said like, all right, yeah, you're right. You're right, that dodge button is dumb. Um, uh, and this also sticks to, I mean, two sticks to just flat surfaces. You're not, like, finding on weird steps or anything. Right, yeah, yeah. Baffling like that. Yeah, that was the yeah, three, man. Uh, uh, you want to just look at the, the menu here just to run down what the what all the yeah, basic options can, are here? We can get back out here to uh, what the other modes here. So, you know, offline versus for, for your one-on-one stuff yep. and online play. That's that's basically... And it's, it's just one-on-one ranked or... Player match. Would you like to acquire information? Uh, about what? I don't know. I guess let's find out. There's information. 
<laughs> That's just, I yeah, I, you know. Yeah. What are the matching options here? Is this worldwide? Worldwide, same, same area. Okay. So, you know. Just region based. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, you know, not no big flashy ranking system, but you do earn battle points for fighting in ranked games, and they keep track of, of that sort of stuff. But, you know, obviously no persistence or, like, crazy earrings or hats for your dudes. Yeah, yeah, it's, none of the characters. No, no like, arcade of, of cards later, Of later stuff. VF games, this is... Yeah. Straight up, Virtua Fighter 2, 2.0, 2.1. Model 2 hardware upends. With online play. Uh, in that theory. No one is playing. We are recording this the day. The day of, it's out. It is out. release here on the 360. Uh, this came out yesterday on the PS3. Mm-hmm. Mm. But uh, this is also that, starting to go. Starting to, to say, how's that? The, the, well, the fizzy insides are starting to. Maybe then this is a good time for you to finish that sauce and for us to switch over to one of the other uh, games here. Um, yeah, let me try a player match. See if we can find anybody mm. there. Yeah, I would like to mm -hmm. see if. Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, okay, this actually does. Okay, it supports more than uh, more than two players. Okay, right on. In the in the player match, so it's not just a one on one situation. That's great. So you can do up to six. It looks like here. That guy's cell phone signal is pretty good. Mm -hmm. But no sense of where hit what region he's in or anything. Uh, any it's his, you can hit select to do or yeah the back button rather to do control options. Yeah, so you know if you're hooking up different controllers or okay, or so you're, you're passing controllers around. And, like stick support. Sure, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna stick with Sarah. I was gonna say, are you straight Sarah? Is that your you see at your this go point, to? I think I am. Yeah. Look at that fire. Fight. Yeah. Ready, go. Oh, we just had this fight. But this time it's for real. Oh no! This is the goofiest jump. Especially with Sarah with the kick. She's like, ha! Yeah. Flying up into the oh. air. Uh, you know, Virtua Fighter was always uh, uh, much more demanding and specific about the, the timing on a lot of its moves. Uh, are you noticing any issues with the online here with regards to, to that stuff so far? It seems fine. Yeah. I mean, I'm not playing at a, you know, that's a super high level where, you know, I would notice every little change and I'm mm. sure, you know, lag is going to impact games. That's, yeah. That's how the internet works, but uh, certainly. But there are some games that are a little more forgiving to ah! that than others. Uh, I, I have no recollection of, of how you know latter day Virtua Fighters have performed online. Uh, VF5 uh, was great, yeah. and then they when they released that downloadable version of Final Showdown. That that worked pretty well too. This is defaulting to the th three. Yep. Matches Japanese here. style best of uh, five, I guess we call it. Yeah. Oh. Knock him off the platform. Oh, that's I shouldn't have been mashing buttons there. I could have actually kicked, ended this fight. Get kicked in the back. Oh. Oh, oh wow. wow. That was beastly. I could have won that fight. I could have won that fight. I should have won that fight, let's say. That guy's drunk. You can't beat a drunk old man. Mm-hmm. I'm just, I, I feel like I'm trying to do moves that do not exist in this game. <laughs> uh. Congratulations, Rob. Great name. Dude got Rob. Yeah. Well done, sir. Nice and short. Like, uh, uh, so, I, I, I saw it there under the player matching options, there was a secret character option along with yeah, a few other things. Uh, you, so. you want to enable or disable Doral, you can, you can do so. All right. Well, let's uh, bounce out of. Yeah, let's uh, let's get move on to uh, fighting vipers here. Oh, my games, and we'll play some fighting vipers. What do you say? All right. Yeah. Not to be confused with fighters mega mix. No, this this is a this is a, a this quick look is like a mega mix of fighters. Okay. So we could call this a fighters mega mix quick look. But it's not a it's not a quick look of fighters mega mix. Just to be super confusing. Mm-hmm. Oh man. This Zot's really bust open. Oh, yeah. When, it, when when you crack it open like that and you get into the crazy fizzy center, it goes bananas. i got to keep this over in the corner of my mouth. Otherwise, this whole quick look's going to derail. You will experience a seizure when exposed to Zot's. Uh, whoa. whoa. <laughs> okay. So, right. uh, I imagine a lot of folks uh, have no context for fighting vipers. 
You're probably right. Like, yeah, this was it's, a uh, very much an also ran in the Sega Saturn era for. Now counting arcades, and you know, it's like they, they, you know, you'll notice the the menu motif. Pretty much the same. And it is a it is a similar game, but you know, they've got like this kind of different. Set I, I, of characters, guitar attack. I'm feeling is that hey, isn't that guy one of the uh uh Planet Harriers dudes, the guy with the guitar? Oh maybe. Raxel. Um but I'm getting a certain uh battle arena Toshinden vibe. Oh God. Well, we ran out of time on the select screen and now we're playing a Serpentor. <laughs> you mean Mahler? No. This uh I like this. We're going on this background. Yeah, so, yeah. And this rotating cage that you're beating Bond's ass in. What's going on in this game, man? Yeah. So armor is a concept here. That's why they have those uh, those icons there. You know, they kind of pop guys up in the air. It's kind of a crazier Virtua Fighter in some sense. Yeah. Um, you got those mid-air recoveries. So Fighters Mega Mix, a lot of it is actually based on the Fighting Vipers style. Oh, look at that. You just destroyed the cage. All right, I'm biting into the shots. I'm sorry. Right, do it. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Feel it. Round one. So unprofessional. Mahler is actually a Go. viper. He is the fightingest. He is the most viper. fighting viper of them all. So, yeah, you, have, you know, kind of moves that, that will bash people away. You know, you kind of more pop-ups and, and juggles and stuff. It's just sort of a yeah. crazier game. You can bust armor off of characters if you hit them enough. Seems like, uh, you know, a lot, maybe a lot faster than uh, the Virtua Fighter 2. Yeah, and you know, th this came out afterwards, and, and you know, more time on the hardware kind of benefited. Uh, I think, uh, I think visually, these characters just look more complicated and stuff than, than the VF2 guys. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna necessarily say better. Uh, yeah, no, let's let's not with the uh, uh, pink rollerblade lady who just busted all of her armor off. Of. Yeah, their, their character design in this game is just weird. Picky! Round one. He's got a skateboard! Why is the K in red? Is that some sort of secret code? You know why. Uh oh. Oh. Picky getting the blocks in there. Not really using his skateboard as much as, as you might think. No, not really. Like, why'd you bring skateboard to a Viper fight? Oh. I'm pretty sure. Viper beats skateboard every time. Snake beats skateboard? Yep. That's how it goes in my sophisticated take on rock, paper, scissors that uh -huh. I'm developing on Kickstarter. I, I'm interested and would like to hear more. Where snake beats skateboard. Entering Armstone. Armstone? Armstone. Armstone. Ah, the wonderful city of Armstone. Armstrong? No, Armstone. Armstone. Oh, Armstone. That's is, where the strip is club that is. A, uh, and there's that weird cage where the, you know, it says no parking, but they built a cage around it. <laughs> so obviously you couldn't park there. And there's the UFO diner, I guess. And it says happy holidays on the back. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck's going on with anything here. This guy's got robot arms and Oh, legs. God, we're going to die. That jet's going to kill us. <laughs> look at look oh, oh! that. I think, that's, I think that's still the Armstone Tower there in the background. So we're still... Yeah, they just built weird little cages around Armstone, around the outskirts. It's like the cage. It's where the high school kids come out to party. Yep. Out near the bike racks. Yeah. Round two. Out Go. South McDowell Extension. It's that plane again. Kind of working these guys, Jeff. Yeah, this is uh, this has not been difficult. So I'm just kind of. And you did leave this at the same normal difficulty I as, did. as you did uh, Virtua Fighter. But I believe Mahler is a hidden character, so it might be. Mm. could be that he is not uh, balanced appropriately. I'd say Sandman! Very, very little about him is appropriate. What is that? That looks ridiculous. I'd... Let's not worry about it. Gone over to the cow patty ice cream parlor. Ugh. Right next to bank. Sheriff office. Yes. <laughs> yeah, right around the corner from sheriff office. Oh, Sandman did me real rotten that time. He is without man. Oh, the KO Corral. Not to be confused with. Nope. Yeah, that makes sense, at least. You know, it's a fighting game. Yeah. KO. Sure. I'll take it. 
Oh. But really, I'm just mesmerized by the uh, weird standy cutouts of cowboy men in the background. Yeah. Fascinating. Weird little time capsule here. What, what, what's, uh, what would you put the publishing uh, year on this game at? Oh, man. Uh, 94. Uh, Five-ish? Six-ish? Six? I was going to say, I'd probably lean towards six. I'm not sure, but... Could have been early 97? Mm. I'm trying to think. VF2... Or VF1 probably came out in... What was it? It was like 92. Yeah, 92 or 93. 91... Uh, not even 91, actually. Round one. Anyway. Let the action begin. Candy is kind of the, the main oh, character. Oh, look at this sick shadow tech, dude. Uh, yeah. oh. <laughs> look at that. Uh, I don't know. Look at that. It's the future. That graffiti there, I think, says, in memory of Honey. I believe it's like an alternate costume for Candy or something. Look for fight. Someone's throwing up sick fighting vipers tags here too. That is a pretty sick tag there. Ah, oh, honey, R.I.P. That's too bad. No skateboarding. Except someone wrote a D on it, so it says "de no skateboarding." Oh. He These says, shadows look terrible. You're supposed to look do skateboards. Oh, okay. All and right. They crossed out the N in no. Yeah. But it doesn't say skateboarding, it just says skateboards. So do skateboards, Do Jeff. skateboards. You I'm know, pretty in, good. In, I, I can do skateboards. I can do... I almost failed out of college in my freshman year because I just got way into doing skateboards. Oh. Fell in with the wrong crowd, like Pika Dog. Just no longer with us. Yeah. That's, that's See you at the crossroads, Piku Dog. You won't be lonely. There we go. And I busted her into her. It was controversial in its era because of scantily clad. Something, something, something. Uh oh. Round one. Let the action begin. Go. Hey, Jeff. Let the action begin. Don't, don't get in the action's way. All right. Guitar guy totally flash kicked me. That's not at all cool. Raxel. He's just, yeah. Is this the part where the game gets tough and makes you put in more quarters? <laughs> yeah, maybe. As far as like, all right, you've had enough of a free ride here. <laughs> Look, you, we, we know you don't really know how to play. You're just kind of bashing around on the buttons, and you don't remember how to, like, do these charge attacks that we're doing to you now. Uh, so, just look. You're going to have to put in more money. Oh, that guy broke my neck. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. All right. The Snake Man wins. Um, 1995. Okay. Uh, for the arcade version yeah. of Fighting Vipers. According to our good friends at the internet. Yeah, I just remember I was already working at GameSpot when it came out for the Saturn, so that would have been post-96. 96. 90, yeah. 96. Uh... November 30th, 1996. Yeah, that makes sense. Viper fights. I'm just curious to see if ah! I'm right about this whole... Damn it. Raxel. Curse you, Raxel. Let's uh, see if there's anyone playing this one online. Looks like... Features wise, they are just keeping these identical across the board. Yeah, I mean, you know, these are these are you know, kind of budget jobs in a sense. Like Sega's done their that SVC collection where they do all that nice work on the front end and everything. This is this is very much not that. Yeah, this is just look, man, connect to Xbox Live to acquire information. I feel like most of their most of Sega's like classic games they've re-released in a, a download format on these consoles this generation. They've gone pretty straight to the point. Well, I mean, like, I mean, Toe Jam and Earl, like, th those games that are specifically labeled as Sega Vintage Collection, most mm -hmm. of them have, like, weird challenges and other leaderboard stuff built in. Or, like, art style filters. Yeah, I mean, they don't they don't go super over the top. You know, they're not HD remixes or anything weird like that. But, 
Uh, they're doing more than the bare minimum. Yeah. I mean, these are the bare minimum, but I think the price is right. And I, I mean, whatever. Like, frankly, it is amazing that Sonic the Fighters is getting a release. Yeah, I agree. In this country as its own separate kind of thing. That's rad. Not just a bonus in some Sonic collection disc or yeah. something. And we found a guy. All right, well, I'm gonna play as uh, as Candy. 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 Let the action begin. Go. <laughs> I like that the there's a like a block like a hit sound effect for a blocked throw. Like a little pop. Oh, ran into the. Eh, don't mind me. Hit you with my butt. Some weird, uh, hit you with his butt. I hate when that happens. He's got more butt to hit you with. Time over. You take that back. Round two. Go. Mm. These are short ass rounds by default. Yeah, that's, I mean, these Sega fighting games always had real short timers. Uh, as far as the the actual like combat systems here, how, like, I mean, not in a qualitative way, but ha like, how does it compare to Virtual Fighter? Or is there the a... buttons are the same. It's block, punch, kick. Okay. Um, you know, like, th there are some different. Uh, you know, if you hit block and punch, you'll do throws just like just like VF. Yeah. Uh, but there's some some differences in terms of just like you know, kind of hitting buttons to recover in the air. Yeah, the little juggle stuff is a little different, and and those charge up moves, which yeah. I'm. There we go. Pop. Sandman's got no upper armor. Uh, is the ah. is the block uh, system timed at all, or is it just no? Uh, you just hold down block. Hold it there. Yeah. Time Dick. Over. Okay, and the the armor smash stuff persists past those yes, rounds. Yeah. Uh, can you still attack dudes when they're on the ground? You get that extra hit in there. Oh, I assume so. I actually don't know. Anyway, Sandman took it to you, man. He did. I busted him up though. We busted each yeah. other's armor off. You know, it was, was kind of hot. And that was a ranked game, so you see, we get uh, uh, some some points there. Battle points. Battle points. Uh, all right, that's fighting vipers. But uh, let's let's play some Sonic the Fighters. Let's here. take it home with Sonic the Fighters. He has been revoked his hedgehog status. I wish that they would put out the well. What what's it even called? I just got eight of fifteen achievements playing that game. For was that the first time? That you first time that I had booted it up. Good lord! So great. Um, it was the Trackball Sonic Arcade game. I think it might have just been so called Sonic the Hedgehog or Sonic Arcade. But it was like a mega low fifty cabinet. Mm -hmm. That's what they they called the cabinet. So for a while, I know when they first started showing it, like at E three or CES or something, like it had that mega low banner, and I thought, like, is this just called Sonic Mega Low or what's going? On? You know, but. Um, when was uh? What's the vintage on this one? We know we know it's also model Sonic, two. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's it's model two, so it's probably right around the same era as Fighting Vipers. It would have been post VF two. Sure. Um. So this is a Sonic the Hedgehog fighting game, and if you played Fighters Mega Mix, some of those characters appeared. Uh, some of the characters from this game appeared in that game. Uh. So th they've released these in the right order, and I really hope that at the end of this process is, hey, here's Fighters Mega Mix. Mm -hmm. Uh, but that was, I don't think, they they did not do an arcade version of that. So that might be a little more work. Right. Uh, Fighters Mega Mix, people have played it. They would have played it on the Saturn, right? Yeah. And did that. Or it, the Gamecom. And that got. Huh? It, and that the got. The Tiger Gamecom. No one played it on the Tiger Gamecom. You didn't even play it on the Tiger Gamecom. I owned it on the Tiger Gamecom, but you were right. I've, I've, I did not play it. <laughs> uh, so blocking is differently. You have barriers. Uh, you know, like, like a Sonic would. Oh, have. okay. Sure. Yeah. I didn't know that Metal Sonic could turn into a jet. To an R wing, apparently. Yeah. Revenge of Dr. Robotnik, spelled with a C for some reason. Yeah, at least they didn't go and 
muddle with that any. Yeah. And there's this Tails themed rocket ship. Get these Chaos Emeralds. Who will save the world? Hey guys, what's up? I'm hanging out on this biplane. 96, there you go. Right there. Man, Sonic looks weird. Look at his little legs. Look at his tiny little stick chicken legs. We're gonna play Sonic. His name's right on the box. <laughs> uh, do you know what the uh, difference is between your automatic and manual there? I believe it's automatic block. Okay. Uh, so same basic controls here, block, punch, kick. Um, but you see when I block, I pull up this barrier and you yeah. see we have a barrier meter. So you can actually get to a point where your all your barriers have been broken mm -hmm. and you can no longer block. Oh, damn. Uh, which is kind of an interesting system. Uh, and is five the default here? Yeah. Okay. That seems like a lot. Uh, th they break pretty easily. So okay. basically, if you block a full combo, you lose a barrier. Okay. And you get some some a bit of a wall bounce there yeah, off that stuff. Is there still a juggle to that, or because it seemed like he bounced pretty far? I don't know. Uh, oh. Uh. Yes. Okay. You can juggle. This is still a Yu Suzuki joint. Yeah? When he was, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, I mean, it's all... When he was still head of all that Sonic stuff. Yeah, and, and some of the characters in this game are ridiculous. I mean, you know, there are not that many characters in the in the world of Sonic the Hedgehog. This is kind of so like... this is kind of one of the prototype, like... I was going to say, Patient Zero for way too many Sonic fucking yeah. characters. So you see how I'm just smacking her barrier away. Oh, yeah. As she's just turtling all this stuff. And now no barrier. Now no she... blocking. I'm beating this poor woman up. Amy Rose, you're out of luck. You weird pink rat lady. And, like, so Sonic's got this, you know, this little punch combo. But he also has this... Oh, oh that's a throw. Um, but he also has this, like, three-hit, three, three hit, like, goose step thing. That's, I'm not really sure how I feel about it. <laughs> Says a lot about Sonic the Hedgehog, I think. It's um, all springtime. Yeah. Uh, but we were on a magic carpet with uh, ring ropes. And uh, the barrier persists between rounds, so you... Oh, yeah, you the, know. the no barrier is still in effect. Yeah. So she screwed up. Yeah, so, like, careful careful use of barrier. Uh, you know, it just... I'm, I'm not going to say it is some huge deep game, but yeah. it, there's more to it than you might think. Um, and there's not actually anything to these rings falling out. It's like you can nah, collect those nah. or... That's just That's for sure. blood. Yeah. Sonic bleeds rings. Getting all these You've got chaos two, emeralds. Two chaos emeralds. Bark, the polar bear. Uh, Bark, I think, <laughs> was one of the characters that's in Fighters Mega Mix. Uh, I don't think I've ever heard of Bark, the you polar know, bark. bear. Also, it doesn't really look like a bear I, very much. I feel like this might be one of the characters that only exists here. Oh. Or like the cartoon. No barrier. That was a throw. Well, throws look fun. They add a little something to those. Yeah. I mean, you can't. At a, I look at get the reflection on the ground there. Like, at a certain point, you, you can't get past, you know, some of the primitive parts here from a, a visual or you know technical uh, yeah, standpoint. Yeah. But, you know, for for a game in '96, an arcade game. I think it looks pretty nice. Yeah, like it's got some personality yeah. to it. And I guess they've—I I haven't seen it for myself, but I guess they've done some work here to this version of the game uh, that they have not done in the past. So there was a character um, that was based—it was a, basically a Sonic version of a Fighting Vipers character, and elements of this character existed in in other versions of the game, but like hidden away, locked away, like no no way to unlock it. It was just like we were working on this, and then we left it in, but it's not actually here. Uh, they have actually fleshed that character out, I guess, and and now you can you can properly play as that character. You throw him out of the ring because it looks like these walls are disintegrating here in this kind of seems like it, yeah. Mushroom cage. But yeah, yeah you know, I, dude, I'm just mashing the punch button. Yeah. <laughs> like, you know, there's not a lot of like punch, punch, kick sort of stuff. Sonic is just doing his thing. Well, they're not being particularly speedy about it. Just kind of 
throwing them bows. Yeah. And I don't think I was actually blasting away those mushrooms. I think that was just the camera perspective made it look like they were going away. Miles Prower. Oh, Tails! Yeah. How come he's the only one who has, like, a full name? Because they needed to write that amazing joke. Oh, man. This AI does not seem to understand the concept of uh, barrier management very well. Yeah. Well, I'm also, you know, just unloading. Although he did just beat you, so. Yeah. Uh, so what's the what's the fight system? Uh... Same deal. Block, punch, kick. Uh, you know, block yeah. and punch to throw. You know, get some different moves if I'm tapping forward in the button, do that little slap. I wonder if there's a proper, is there, yeah, command list. We can actually, hey. Punch, punch, oh, kick. punch, kick. Punch. Okay. Right. Triple punch. Double punch, triple punch. Punch, punch rush. rush. Super rush. Rush spin. So punch, 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 down and punch. Punch close to opponent and then all three buttons. Point, punch, spin, scissor punch, volley toss, toss and attack, wind up punch. All right, a little half circle. Kick, and kick, some kick, kicks and stuff. Smack back, kick. Okay, okay. And that was that smack back kick. That's the little. You know, want to do a. Nice. Yeah. That'll do. Get oh. dark apparently. Oh. Yes, so a little jump attack there. And Tails just He's trying to go for it there. there. Kind of doing some sidestepping. Mm -hmm. Is that a mechanic or is that something that's happening automatically that with side mechanic. steps? Yeah, okay. That's, yeah. That third dimension. Bang the sniper. What kind of animal is a sniper? Uh, like a wolf. I mean, his name is Fang, so. So Sniper Wolf? Yes. Yeah. Figures back into Middle Gear Solid fiction? Yes. I'm going to punch the barrier away because. Oh, you get the little, the yeah. little bumper bounce sounds yeah. on the casino stage. Cool. And he's, he is, that guy's shooting at it's me. It's cheating. He's shooting corks at you. It's fucked up. Oh. He had no regard had, for your barrier yeah. there. Had me on tilt. Had me guessing. Guessed wrong. Bringing a gun to a Sonic fight. It's sort of messed up. It does seem like the timing on those juggles is pretty specific. Uh, you know, it's range and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta... Oh! Oh, there's a third hit there. Nice. All right. Pulled it out there at the end. All right, one more. Let's see if you get all these damn emeralds. I want to see Dr. Robotnik get his. Oh. Just throwing the guns in the air now. Yeah. Fang just tossing them off. There you go. Back to the desert with you, Fang. Is that the, the Fang fan fiction you're working on? Where Fang lives in the desert? Well, I figure he's going to get buried in the desert Being outside. Being the dynamite. Of... I, come on. It just, it's just nonsense now. It's like no one's paying any attention to what Yu Suzuki's doing. Oh. And also, those are like black bombs, not dynamite. Uh, maybe there's dynamite. I mean, you know, there could be dynamite inside the bombs. I guess. I feel like when you say dynamite, though, you're expecting yeah. red sticks. So it'll almost uh, be worth it for me to just like give up this first round if I can just bust this whole barrier. Yeah. And then hope to just win it back. Oh, that sucks. That does suck. Oh, he kicked that bomb at me. What 
kind of good thing is I can I can sort of block those bombs forever because they they do not they will not cost barrier. Assuming there is no like charge up super move that involves those bombs. Right. It looks like that gets right through your barrier. But nothing doing that time. That's right, Bean. Duck the green. You think that would have been a better name? I, I feel like there is zero connection or, or a tenuous connection between the names and anything else about these things. Oh, God. Oh, All right. Hey, oh. Time getting close to expiring oh, here. Oh, I got to get up oh, and hit him. Oh. oh! Damn you, Bean. You lose. Special tips. We'll never know. How the arcade so, mode see if ends any here. Yeah. Oh, so that type A stuff, is, it kind of governs how the barriers work. So you okay. Kinda... Let's acquire some information, shall we? Here you go. Thank you. Information acquired. Right away. <laughs> I think this, you know, this, this one is... It's the most unusual of the... For sure, yeah. Uh, of the trio that they've released this week, uh, I, I, I think. <sighs> Should I try... I don't know. I don't know. Be someone crazy? I'm gonna try Tails. Oh, so he picked uh, Player 2 Color Sonic, which is just... Oh, no, I guess that was because I was on Sonic when he picked him. But uh, if you both pick the same character, you get, like, a black and white. It looked like he set this to manual also. Uh, I mean, that's, that's what I was using. Always. Oh, was it? Okay. Yeah, so instead of like having that full five punch combo, whoa! Oh, that took a lot of barrier. Oh, did that take more than one barrier? Oh, Jesus! Yeah. yeah. And the one barrier you have left is flashing. Dang. Yeah, so instead of traveling forward on all his punches, Tails throws that two and then freaks out. Yeah. Sark got you on the ropes. That little spin-up move he's doing there. He didn't even hit you! Dastardly. Hmm. I'm getting the feeling this guy knows how to play Sonic the Fighters. Sort of, kind of, yeah. Well, he has over 40 matches under his belt already oh, today. Jesus Christ. So Okay, well, so well he's, then. he's been playing for a while. Uh, so, yeah, that's uh, that's Sonic Fighters. I think it's great that, that these have been released. Mm -hmm. uh, this one especially, it's it's just, uh, you know, it, it was just so obscure for so long and, yeah, and not, totally. a, not a necessarily easy game like they released this get your hands as, on. as part of some weird collections on like the ps2 and yeah, GameCube yeah. era uh, and that's where the, the name change comes from right. they called it sonic championship there because let's face it sonic the fighters not <laughs> not necessarily a north american sounding name but i think no. it's great that they kept it no and did this ever have a u.s arcade release uh, I mean, you could find it, but I don't think it ever was properly yeah. officially released. Right. I think you know importers may have may have brought it over here. And I played it at trade shows and stuff, kind of you know before it was out, and then never saw it again. So, Virtua so. Fighter Two, Fighting Vipers, and Sonic the Fighters, three separate. Yeah, three things. separate things, three separate purchases. They're five bucks a pop here on the Xbox. So you can pick and choose uh, which weird. I assume uh, that the same price on PS3. Uh, yeah, yeah and, and that's not accurate. Some, some plus deal or something like that, but. Uh, yeah, I, I, that's that's pretty cool. Um, Good little Sega novelty, you know, piece of piece of history there. Yeah, need to see it. Uh, so a, a weird era. Uh, now they here. just need to move on to Fighters Mega Mix. 
Close the loop. I agree. I want to see that fighting car, man. Uh, I played some. The, the problem is with Fighters Mega Mix is you got to play. You got to do some stuff to unlock that car. Yeah, it's not there from the get go. I played mm -hmm. some Fighters Mega Mix recently and didn't have a save. Mm. Was really bummed out. You can play as the big bear though, and the bear spins around all crazy. The big like like inflatable looking bear. Oh yeah, yeah. That thing's stupid. Well, here's here's hoping that 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 comes, but. Until then, you've Until got then. these three games. Uh, Jeff, thanks for uh, giving us a look here. Absolutely. At, at this Fighters Mega Mix. No, no. I'm sorry. <laughs>